I think you need to cool it with this caffeine. What is this, like three cups well, now? I, I barely had a moment to sleep. Scenario after scenario has been running through my brain. Like, what if Maxie pleads guilty to the arraignment today? If she does, I'll have to argue with emotional duress and ask for a lesser sentence. Well, that's unacceptable. Well, unless she comes to her senses, that's her only option. Well, aren't we here early to hopefully convince her otherwise? Yeah, we've all tried before and we failed. Uh, that's it. I'm cutting you off. You're done. You're done. Maxie. Where's the judge? I asked them to bring you up early. I want to talk to you. Why? Everyone's already said what they need to say. Not everyone. No doubt you're still mourning for Dr. Robin, as we all are, but now is not the time for a heart now to Now is the perfect time. You need to go. Wait, in an abandoned Maxie in this critical state? No. This is a family affair. If he wants to talk to her, you need to let him. Okay, with all due respect to your brother's grief and his desire for closure, this is the worst thing he can do to Maxie right now. I'll be fine. This conversation's way overdue. Go. Come back for the arraignment. I will keep my eye out, make sure everything is okay. Trust me. Against my better judgment, I will vacate the premises, but I'll return soon. That's a promise. Greetings. Hey. Am I interrupting? No, no, come on in. Oh, okay. Um, are you looking for something? Is first time at the back from our trip No, she's yet? not. She's actually following up on that lead that uh, you gave me about the hospital, so I... Spinelli. Huh? What? What's going on with you? I just... I've worked on a case of the utmost urgency. And actually, I could use your counsel. Okay, what kind of case? Oh, an extremely personal one. One, if it goes unsolved, has very dire consequences. Okay, if, if you need any, if you're in any kind of trouble. No, no, can... no, it's not me, it's Maxie. She could spend the rest of her life in prison. You want a reason. You want someone to blame, even if it's yourself. Maxie won't stop until properly punished, even if that punishment stems from a crime that she did not, in fact, commit. I, I know how she feels. I blame myself, too. Well, the explosion was no more your fault than hers. Robin went back into that lab to get the drug that she made for me. If she didn't, she'd still be alive. But that was that was her decision. No, I, I was angry at her for making that decision. Spinelli, I was angry at myself. No person or, or thing is accountable for Robin's death. I mean, there are so many factors that could have altered the outcome. That's exactly what you have to help Maxie understand. I'm grateful as always for your wisdom. Ugh. What? Well, well, while I subscribe wholeheartedly to your theory, there's always the possibility that Maxie won't see reason, and, and that she'll still plead guilty, and then she'll be condemned to a life behind bars. So find the real killer. The real killer? Somebody murdered Lisa Niles. If you can prove it wasn't Maxie, then she's off the hook. Whether she likes it or not. Careful. The real killer probably thinks they're in the clear and they're not going to want you asking questions. I should be stealth itself. Especially around Anthony. That first thing Maxie said about him being involved in the cover-up, it's probably true. Yeah, indeed, that is the most troubling aspect. Maxie, she must have had some guilty knowledge of the murder and gone to the elders of the car for help. I wish there was more I could do, but, you know, Sonny's uh, trial's about oh, to right. start. No, say no more. Hey, uh, was the information that Bernie and I collected on the former FBI agent, was that useful? I'm, I'm hoping there's something in here that's going to give me leverage against McBain, but it's really not going to matter if Sonny gets convicted. Why, why doesn't Stone Cold follow his own advice? You know, prove Mr. Sir innocent by finding the real perpetrator like I intend to do with Maxie. Yeah, good luck. Yeah, to you as well. Ah, oh, but first I have to prevent her from pleading guilty. If it's not too late. You have three plea options. Not guilty, asserting that you did not commit the crime, in which case we shall proceed to trial. No low contendry, neither disputing the charges nor admitting guilt, in which case we shall proceed in like kind. And guilty, in which your right to trial is waived and we proceed directly to sentence. How do you I, I now fully understand why you're doing this. Young man, what are you doing? Uh, uh, me? Take a seat yeah, yeah, or you'll be escorted out. Yes, sit down. It's been taken care of. Don't worry about it, okay? I'll ask the defendant again. How do you plead? Your Honor, my client guilty. pleads not. I'm guilty on all charges. 